Hey everyone, it's Drew with GeoArm, and I am back to talk to you about the 2GIG GC2E and how to program and edit user codes. So, what we're going to do first is we're going to go ahead and get into our security menu. Then we're going to hit menu again. Then we're going to hit toolbox. Once you're here, they're going to they're they're actually wanting your master user code. Uh, in this case, it's factory, so I'm going to go ahead and just enter 1111. It'll get us in there. At this point, you want to go ahead and go into user management, and then you can edit any of the codes here. So, uh, what I'm going to do here is I'm, I'll edit the master code. So, the primary code for the master right now is 1111. So, you, you press on that, and then a new menu will pop up. You'll see where it says change pin, and it'll have the current code next to it. Go ahead and hit that, and then you can change it to whatever you'd like. In my case, I'm just going to go ahead and make it 1234. Hit OK, and then they want you to confirm it. OK, all right. So code for user one has been successfully changed. At this point, my pin is now one, two, three, four. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and change that back just so I don't lock myself out by accident. But let's go ahead and just change that back to one, 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 one. All right, now. We are going to go ahead and add a new user. So if you wanted to add a different code besides your own master code, you would just go ahead and hit the next available user. In this case, it's add user two. And then they're going to want the four digit code. I'm going to go ahead and make this one 2580, right down the middle of the keypad, 2580. All right, so new user two successfully has been created here. And uh, at this point, it'll prompt a menu with some different options. What you should see here is the alarm system should recognize this user's pen. And then there's always, never, or you can schedule a time uh, for the code to actually work. So uh, between these hours, it'll, it's more so for like a, a business or something like that. But um, at this point, it, it's, it's set to always. So my code is 2580 for a secondary code. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is how you add and edit codes on the 2GIG GC2E. Any questions or comments, please leave them below. You guys take care. Make sure to subscribe to our YouTube page and click the Show More tab underneath the video where you can view valuable links pertaining to this product, similar how-to videos, and our low-cost, no-contract alarm monitoring services.